Number 11 asks, calculate the number of moles of ammonia gas contained in a 3 liter vessel at 3.00 times 10 to the second Kelvin with a pressure of 1.50 atmospheres. So I read this and it asks for moles. And so there's scandalously few ways to find moles. And then it goes on to tell me temperature, volume, and pressure. So my mind jumps right to PV equals NRT. And if we're going to solve for moles, we're going to rearrange this. So we'll divide by RT on each side, and we end up with moles equals PV over RT. Pressure, so what does it say our pressure is? So pressure, volume, R and T. Pressure, it says is, so it gives us 1.50 atmospheres, Atmospheres is a measure of pressure, so that's our pressure. It also says 3.0 liters, so 3.0 liters. That kind of catches my eye uh, sig fig wise. That's only two sig figs, so that means my answer is only going to get rounded to two sig figs. Uh, R is 0 0.0821. Uh, the unit on R is atmosphere liters per mole. Kelvin, and so atmospheres, liters, that's cool, and then temperature will be in Kelvin, and it's 3.00, 3.00, three sig figs, but that's, we're rounding to two anyway, uh, times 10 to the second Kelvin. And then we'll go ahead and plug that into the equation. So, 1.50 times 3.0 divided by 0 0.0821 times, I'm just going to call it 300 because that's what 3 times 10 to the second is. And th that though is 1 sig fig. I know that this is 3 sig figs, so then I can keep that. Um, 1.5 times 3 is 4.5. That's about a tenth, so it's going to be about 4.5. Well, four and a half divided by about 30 or uh, a little less than 30. So let's call it five divided by 30. So that's a sixth. So uh, we're looking at about a sixth of a mole. Punch that into your calculator. 1.5 times three divided by 0 0.0821 times 300. And it comes out to be one or point. 180.1827 moles, rounding that to two significant figures. Our answer is going to be 0 0.18 moles, and the substance I think was ammonia, and so NH3, and that is our final answer.